Allen took the full 15 minutes. Here well, we Sabres go. Sabres had value. Uh, with the uh, 15th pick in the 2004 NFL Draft, the Tampa Bay Buccaneers select Michael Clayton, wide receiver, oh. LSU. Well, I, I, I can tell you he is one of the names on my list of guys that Bucks were looking at. Well, I was John Gruden go likes big, bad receivers. Go ahead, Mel. You look at him, you look at that big, he is six to eight, he's 210, and I think when you look at the ability that he has, now he doesn't have the incredible vertical jump, he doesn't have the 435, the 445 speed, but you see the ability there to adjust to the poorly thrown ball. I tell you, you look at the ability after the catch for Michael Clayton not having the great speed, he is quick, and he is an excellent route runner. Precision and timing, you see the ability to extend to play taller than six two and a half. You see the cornerback there cannot keep up. Quickness out of his break, the feet, the ability there to separate, he has, and the toughness. Nick Saban thought, had he played safety on the defensive side, he could have been an All-American at that spot. Michael Clayton is a talent. Michael Clayton's only weakness. When I went through every category of playing wide receiver, people in the NFL, yes to everything except for the 4-4-5 four, four, speed. He runs in the 4-6 area. Michael Irvin didn't have 4-4 four, four speed. Jerry Rice didn't. A lot of receivers, Terrell Owens didn't. But they were effective, and they weren't possession. They were big play. Quick throw, pass is complete. That's Clayton, and he is wrapped up instantly. A gain of only one. So tight to the vest. They need to stretch this defense a little bit. On first down, Johnson fires, and he hits his rookie Clayton, who's out to the 40. Timing in a timing passing game. Here's Johnson looking that way. Throws for Clayton, and the rookie goes up and makes a catch. Nice job by the first rounder taking him into Seahawk territory. We take it out to Los Angeles. Sims has time over the middle, and that's complete. Michael Clayton. The stone, I think, in this half was the one he threw the touchdown pass to Tim Brown. Got some time. Pass is caught. Michael Clayton, 26 yard pickup. Mike said, John, you, you just do whatever you think's right. It's fine with me. Third down pass, wide open, and the catch is made by Clayton, the rookie, and he's touched down by Lynch. He didn't get up in time, I don't think. Now they're going to say that Lynch didn't touch him until he was already on his feet. That is a touchdown, Tampa Bay. Oh, John Lynch is going to argue this. John Lynch thought all he had to do was tap Michael Clayton and he would be down by contact. That's only true if, if Clayton's knee is still on the ground. Lined up in the neutral zone. That penalty is declined. First of all, watch the catch by Clayton. Whoa! Is he up when... Yes, he is. He has his knees off the ground, and he's up on all fours when John Lynch touches it. Let's see, does Michael Clayton get up off the ground before he's touched? Yes, he is. He's on all fours. That's an excellent ruling by the officials. And Lynch trying to be a gentleman about touching him down, and it cost the Broncos a touchdown because he could have uh, made a cover corner. He gets a Deion Sanders award, doesn't he? <laughs> Johnson to the throw. Almost intercepted, and then it's caught on the ricochet. And he's by Michael Clayton, the second outstanding catch of this half. The rookie, Clayton. Well, Michael Clayton is having an out-of-body experience. This ball looks like it's going to be picked off. Watch the elevation underneath by D.J. Williams. But Michael Clayton, this guy's on fire. He's called out the signals at the line. 
Sims with the inside handoff to Michael Clayton. Clayton with some room, gets to the right side inside the 15, down to the 11. First down, Bucks to Bucky Jones, finally drove him out of bounds. Boy, I love the call. The favorite son comes home. The last time Michael Clayton was here, he was winning a national championship. Watch Clayton in the bunch set. They fake the toss to Pittman. They come back with the underneath handoff to Clayton. This guy was a star at LSU. They won a national championship here last January, coming home and making a mark early in this ball game. He's definitely the Buccaneers' most explosive offensive player. Backfield wide receiver on the right side. Sims to pass on first down. Pocket holds, looks, throws. Got to complete to Clayton across the 40 to the 45, out to the 46-yard line to Bucky Jones with a stop, gain of 21. Bucks have it with a freedom. Be a fun one to watch. So stay tuned for game two of our doubleheader. Greasy back to pass again on first down. Looking for Clayton. Got him inside St. Territory down to the 41 yard line. Fred Thomas will hit an all stop. Back in the pocket. Looking left side. Throws to Clayton. Got him first down at the 43 yard line. Nice connection there between Greasy and the rookie out of LSU, Fred Thomas, in coverage. We're talking about him all day. He's a great finisher. Boy, he's really he's really played well through the first five ball games of this season. He's going to be a star in this league. I tell you what, he shows the poise of somebody who's been around for a while. It does not look like a rookie out there. You know, left shoulder. That's all we know at this point, but he has not returned. We don't expect him to return. Clayton on the end around finds some room inside St. Territory and down to the 45-yard line. On that play defensively. Brian Greasy in his seventh season out of Michigan, and his first pass is caught for a first down by Michael Clayton, a great-looking rookie, their number one draft choice. Third down and five. Bucks ball at the 50-yard line. Greasy protected well, swings it out of the pocket to Clayton, and only because he was stumbling as he made the grab that he not get into the end zone. And showed blitz backed off. Greasy throws, and that is caught. Nice grab and enough for the first down as it is taken in by Michael Clayton. Again, second and three. Clayton to the 21 yard line. Three man rush shown by the Rams. Greasy has to convert and does to the rookie Clayton. And Clayton is out of bounds at the 33 yard line. He's the Bucks out first down from the 34. I'll call him Bob before the day's over. Throwing on first down to Clayton. Clayton has been nothing short of sensational. That's a Bucks first down at the 49. First and goal. Greasy to throw for a touchdown to Clayton. Want to see the ball caught, so the defender's never going to get the benefit of the doubt. Greasy completes it to Clayton, who makes a catch in traffic and has a first down at the 33. Mike Green brings him down. Good sign, at least initially. He's replaced by Sean Mahan once again. Greasy throwing this time. Michael Clayton with the seam. Clayton, what a beautiful run! Clayton. there and Gus one of the guys we got to keep on an eye on today is Michael Clayton and you talk about making an impact as a rookie this guy's come in Jervicious was hurt Joey Galloway was hurt and the Bucks have been riding the spectacular exploits of this young man the rookie wide receiver we've seen him all over the field making blocks second and five at the 45 greasy down the middle Clayton with the catch and they're in field goal range with 13 seconds left eight Greasy throws wide open Clayton he's in touchdown a beautiful play Greasy almost tripped Pittman picked up the blitz Greasy throws and completes to Clayton and he's taken out of bounds at the 30 yard line the end in the backfield Greasy Finds Michael Clayton. Clayton across midfield. And a Falcons terrible. We'll replay it third and 11. 49ers bring pressure. Or at least they show it. They bring it. Parrish blitzes. They go back to the same side. That one will stay. Same play. Same receiver. Same corner. Same result. 
running. If you're going in week 12. Giants wearing their red throwback jerseys today. And this pass caught by Clayton for a first down. It's his fourth reception. An eight. Buccaneers need the 42. And they pick up another first. It's Michael Clayton, his fifth reception of this first half. First down. Greasy over the middle. Michael Clayton, first down and more down to the... Carolina, 23. Leaving for Pittman last week. Third down and four. As Greasy throws over the middle, it's caught by Clayton for a Buccaneers first down, a 15-yard. Greasy steps up, throws over the middle, first down, out to the 39-yard line, crossing the 40 is Michael Clayton. Second and 10. Good protection for Greasy. Good throw by Greasy, and it's Clayton inside the 35. A first down for the Buccaneers. Greasy to throw on third and two. Catch made at midfield, 48-yard line. They'll stop the clock as Tampa Bay. Greasy steps up, throws to a wide open Clayton, and he's out close to midfield at the 48-yard line. I'd be able to go out and play aggressive. Greasy looking to the end zone. And what a catch made by Clayton. Touchdown, Tampa Bay. A remarkable catch by the rookie out of LSU. And a point after will tie this game at 21. My goodness, Michael Clayton. This guy doesn't play like a rookie. Watch him. He gets outside of Quentin Jammer, but then he finds the ball and jumps back inside of Jammer right there. Look at that extension. Great concentration. He's got those long. Right chip. Brian Greasy throwing his first pass in the second half. Michael Clayton, the rookie, is wide open in the Saints territory. Knocked out at the 42 after a pickup of 22. Second down and seven. Slant caught by Clayton. And the tremendous rookie, Michael Clayton, takes it out to the 44 yard like this. Greasy on third and three, complete Clayton. And he oh, does oh, for wow. the end zone, touchdown! <laughs> Woo. How far did he leap for that? He didn't know what direction he was going. He didn't know if he was going for a somersault, if he was doing a backflip. I and mean, he just jumped whoo, from the six yard line, helicopter backflip. Oh, yeah, that's going to make a highlight reel. And he still hung on to the football. Think about the last two touchdowns that have been scored against Carolina. Get that body. Michael Vick last yeah. week. Empty backfield on second and goal. Here he comes. Greasy to the back of the end zone. Touchdown. Michael Clayton. Happens. Always seems like one is always coming back on the other. Clayton. Michael Clayton takes it down to the Panthers 14-yard line. He picks it enough to make a difference. And when you're playing a 6-0 ball game, that field goal could mean everything. Clayton. Clayton's going to run away. Michael Clayton, one man to beat for the house. Starks does a good job. Did he get him? Did he go out of bounds? They're calling touchdown. I don't know that he went out of bounds. One, one official is saying touchdown, touchdown. One's got him out of bounds. They go touchdown. 75 yards for Michael Clayton, his seventh touchdown of the year.